please help me. How do I know this blockchain is real or just not some fake that you put on the website? No, this is a good question. And uh, what we try to do as a company, and nobody has done this before, is we will hire in the next four to six weeks an auditor, so a proper auditor who will audit the blockchain every month. Now, I don't know of any cryptocurrency who does this. So there will be a person, an auditor, a professional person who is uh, by law very knowledgeable and an expert with an IT team. And these people will check the blockchain every month so no coins are mined outside the chain and no transactions made outside. Now this, I think, is really much more than any other company I know does. And uh, we want to provide this for our members who, as I say, many of us are not IT experts, but they, uh, you know, they want to know. Why do we measure the difficulty in tokens? Now, tokens are our internal currency. So we measure the, the tokens in a financial model. Every token has a value. As we know, we have them on the exchange. We have them everywhere in the packages. So these tokens um, are um, um, in, um, in, our, um, in our system. And this is how we measure uh, the difficulty. The value of the tokens we calculate based on the market value, measured based on the number of splits and based on some promotions on the market. And this is actually how this functions. What will come in the next days is this one here, which will show you when the next mining difficulty will come. The next mining difficulty, this I can say on this webinar, uh, I have not communicated yet, will come after 43.2 million of coins have been mined. Then the difficulty will go up by 0 0.25 tokens. Now, we will give you from next week two options on automatic mining. Today, it's like this. All of your tokens go into the mining. From next week on, you can choose two options. One can be go with all tokens, or one can be only with new token. But if you press today, it will be uh, all token. Yeah? So, from next week, we give you both options. The value of a coin increases by several uh, several points. One is uh, the base, the customer base. The more people we are, the more valuable a coin is. Uh, for example, Bitcoin um, is um, Bitcoin is uh, a currency which is very well known. This is why it is so valuable. We had coins valued at about one thousand dollars. So the bigger our network becomes, the higher our price will become because more and more people want to come to the network. The second thing which is very, very important for the value of the coin is the mining difficulty. Normally, if you pay to create an asset, let's say one euro, asset costs also one euro on the market. So the one of the main drivers is the new coins that we mine and the mining difficulties. 